I bought this from a KNF. What is it called? It's called an angle. I don't know what it's called, but it allows me to fit this on my tripod and get close to the ground or at a strange angle. I can tilt this, I can extend this. So with those two, I can get this into any position. That allows much more flexibility for your tripod. And I've found it invaluable, especially for macro. I've taken the centre column from my tripod and used this and this allows me to get really close to the ground rather than you don't want to put your camera upside down and all that messing about. So this is just a very versatile thing. They, they also do a tripod with uh, one of these incorporated in it. Um, I can get it like that to shoot straight down. It's just so, it's so good and it's not that expensive. You've got a hook here which you can use to weigh it down if you need to. But I um, find this uh, invaluable complement to my tripod. This is a, a simple shot of some leaves and we've got the uh, camera orientated on the tripod so we're face down and we've got the arm extended quite away so it's important to keep the plane of the uh, leaves in the same plane so the focus isn't a problem. This is the simple shot of the leaves and um, we've process this in Lightroom just to bring out the colours. Um, it is autumn so we've sort of uh, got these autumnal colours. Uh, please uh, like and subscribe and hit the bell icon uh, if you like this uh, shot. Also if you could uh, comment down below um, or any queries you've got please let us know. Right, this is another shot um, of some small group of fungi and we've got the tripod wedged there and the arm extended a little bit and we adjusted the ball head so we get exactly the right position that we want whereas to use this with a, a conventional um, centre column would be almost impossible. Um, I've tried it and uh, it's much easier with this. This is a group of fungi and the biggest one probably is 100 millimeters. Um, and this little grouping, what we've done is a bracketed shot and we've uh, processed this in Helicon Focus and also in, in Lightroom. I've illuminated uh, these with a, a small handheld LED light which uh, adds sort of light into the subject. Well, this is another setup and we've got um, some fungi here that are, are probably uh, only 50 centimetres and uh, we've, again we've got the tripod in a solid position um, with the arm that we've been able to move up and down to get the correct position. Um, and also adjust the ball head so we're just in the right sort of place. I 
Again, this is a, a bracketed shot, uh, processed in Helicon Focus and Lightroom. And the idea of bracketing is that you're taking uh, the focus, uh, slices of focus right the way through the image so that uh, when you combine them in Helicon Focus that everything then becomes sharp. So you basically stack them. This is the next setup and um, we're sort of photographing these uh, little fungi which are probably only one centimetre high. Uh, and again we've got the uh, macro lens on this time and we've got the tripod position really stable um, and focusing on these tiny tiny fungus. And again, this is uh, processed in Helicon Focus and Lightroom. And you can see that uh, it really uh, brings out the sort of detail in these, considering how small they are. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, please like this uh, video. And if you've got any queries or anything you want to ask, just put it down below to let us know and we'll respond to it. We'll see you again next time.